Good afternoon, it's Skip with Earn My Bad. So today I had on the schedule to talk about a few different things and I decided to scrap all that. In the last week, we've had three mass killings. We've had California, Ohio, and Texas. Um, and those are tragic incidents and it made me think. A lot of times, you know, one of the questions I got asked a lot of times during my uh, assignment in recruiting was, you know, what does it have, what does it take? What are you looking for? What are the agencies looking for in their police officers? And with this in the back of my mind, I think a good analogy is, do you have it? Do you have what it takes? And that it fact, that in fact, that it factor comprises a lot of different things. But today let's talk about, are you the type that's gonna be sitting on the sidelines? Are you gonna be the type of person who reacts? In each one of those incidents, those tragic incidents, you had firefighters, you have paramedics, you had police officers, you had sheriffs who responded, who went to that location and tried to do the right thing. They weren't the type who was going to stand by and watch. They weren't the type who was going to stand by and videotape. They weren't going to be the type who stand by and stood and talked about how someone should be killed. They were the type of people, they were the men and women So, do you have what it takes? Are you the type of person who's going to stand by, or are you going to be the type of person who's going to take action? And I'm not talking about the type of person who wants to be a hero who does something for the glory, for the fame, because more often than not, that type of person is going to get people hurt. But as you look around every day, you'll see people who spring into action to help in car accidents, uh, to help someone across the road, someone who falls down needs help of who we are is are we the type of person who's going to help and do something. So as you go forward this week, take a look and ask yourself, do you have it? Are you the type of person who is going to be at the forefront or are you going to be the type of person who stands by on the sidelines? Um, Sunday afternoon, you know, uh, I hope you guys had a good weekend. Uh, tomorrow's Monday and the start of another work week for most people and for those of you guys who are uh, work and night shift. It's going to be the start of your weekend. So with that, uh, enjoy the week, whether it's your work, the beginning of your work week or the beginning of your weekend. And uh, we'll talk to you later. Have a good one.